Max Haygarth on the ball. Nice reverse pass from Belusa. Good return cross there, low cross, and made net just about deal with it. But a good pass by uh, Locko finds Ree Smith. Smith breaking over the halfway line. Tries to feed the ball. Lovely ball through to Abrahams. Abrahams with a shot, but uh, he was angle was a bit too tight for him and an energy save for uh, Ethan Ross. But uh, first shot on target after six plus two minutes, eight minutes, Michael. Yeah. And Pettit there with the shot that uh, maybe a feeling he should have done better with it. Came through a crowd of players. I think Massey went for the ball. Maybe Wait, that man. obstructed him. Certainly more interesting than Keith Higgins, that's for sure. <laughs> yeah, it does roll off the tongue quite nicely. It does, actually. As Osborne tries to clip the ball forward. Abiloza does well to shield the ball away from Lati Fairweather. Linny out wide, but gets to Haygarth. A nice one, too. And then he's got the chance to cross it forward. Cochran just flicks the ball away from the onrushing newbie. Thanks, Crawford. Haygarth tries to get past Lati Fairweather. Was he caught there? No, he wasn't. Lati Fairweather, Haygarth with a chance. Good shot on target, but well read by Craig Ross. And uh, Haygarth just getting a bit of space there. Just managed to get the better of Lati Fairweather. Didn't quite get enough power on the shot to trouble Ross too much, but still a half-decent save, Michael. Yeah, he got the better of Lati Fairweather there. Should have done a little bit better. Pettit with a low cross. Locko was still up there. Pettit rushing to win well and does so well, but uh, dispossessed by Osborne. The chance for Reagan and Linney, Linney and on the far side, Newby to break. Up against Cochran. Going to cut inside, and Reagan, Reagan, Reagan Linney at the far post, nearly got on the end of that cross there from Crawford. Got Elliot, <coughs> Elliot Osborne and, uh, I was going to say Alex Newby, but Newby's moved away, Osborne to take the free kick. And is there, number 16 with the goal, James Jones, just attacked the ball, perfect free kick there by Osborne, and that spell of pressure mark we've been talking about has paid off for the away side. First goal of the game's gone to Altrincham. Mainland United nil, Altrincham won. Yeah, and it's been coming. They've thoroughly deserved it. The last 10 minutes, they've been the better side. And great ball in there. And header met by James Jones. Bullet header. I think that's a, it's, I mean, it's a great finish right into the bottom corner. And it's looking like they're going to half, half time with a deserved lead. Just three sides with a 100% record after two games. Gateshead, Eastley and Oldham. Anyway, good pass in by uh, Cochrane and Johnson trying to squeeze into the near post. And ball hit the side netting. I thought for a minute the keeper might have got a hand on it, but I think it hit the side netting first and it's gone out for a goal kick. But a uh, bit of incisive play there by Maidenhead. Yeah, and it was a good strike this time by Johnson. Hit it low and hard. It just was a tight angle. It was always like very similar to Abraham's in the first half. Hard. Nice interchange here and a chance here for uh, on Hagarth who gets the shot in, but uh, Ross saves with his feet. Nice through ball there by uh, Linney and a good chance for Hagarth there, but good save by Craig Ross, Michael. Once again, it's really good football by Altringham, just ripping through the heart of the maidenhead defence. Good ball through Hagarth. You'd hope he'd do a little bit better there, but decent enough so save by Ross. Maidenhead have got seven minutes of added time to try and salvage something from this game. And to be honest, to try and get their season started, which really has been derailed. But a chance now, Mikulski can break forth from that loose pass. Got Smith outside. Smith with the shot. He's getting over it just wide. Loose pass there in midfield by Altringham. Mikulski did well, Fedry Smith, Smith just stumbled a little bit, tried to go for placement, the right thing to do, but just didn't quite get the angle right, and the ball goes low. wide. Ball ricochets kindly for him. Got to try and win that ball, Cavallo, and he's still got the ball, tussling well. Is that a handball there? The crowd are appealing for it. Referee said no. That was a difficult one, and he's, uh, I think he's booked Mikulski for his protests. Pettit. For Josie. 
The cross in. Is it too close to the keeper? It is. One of those balls that curled so nicely for the keeper. And I think the referee's blown for the final whistle. He has. Third defeat of the season for Maynet here at York Road. Going down to James' Jones goal in the first half. Brief summary from you, Michael, on another disappointing performance by Maidenhead. Yeah, Maidenhead will be disappointed. I mean, Altrincham did edge the first half and they were awarded when James Jones scored a header from an Osborne free kick. He met the, met the header really well. He's right into the bottom corner. Second half, very limited on chances. Maidenhead did edge it on chances, I'd say. You had Johnson, who just dr dragged one in um, wide from a tight angle. Smith did something very similar. And they just couldn't find the breakthrough Maidenhead. And you have to say that Altrincham deserved the three points today.